Hello and welcome to my second YouTube video. This video is super short because I didn't record a lot of the process, but I'm not gonna waste this footage because I think that's stupid and I like this drawing a lot, so I'm posting it because I can. I just kind of recently started drawing people again, so something that's been really helpful to me is referencing photos of like other animated things or just poses of actual people and stylizing it to my style so that I can help discover certain things that I like doing with my art, and I think it's fun. I'm also learning digital art at the same time, so that's fun and hard, but I've been learning a lot, and I learned a lot, especially with this drawing, which I really enjoy, and I'm very proud of it. <laughs> the line art on this drawing was kinda difficult because I decided to make a lot of it difficult for myself because I wanted it to look really good, and I think that I lived up to my expectations because certain aspects of this drawing I've never really done before, especially on digital art. So I'm definitely not mad at how it turned out. I'm very, very proud of it. I never like realized how hard voiceovers would be because you just have to sit and talk. And at the same time, I feel like if I don't talk and leave some areas like silent, I will get bored. Cause I know when I watch videos, sometimes I get bored when I'm just watching things and not hearing anything because I don't know I don't know if that's normal but that's me and I'm strange so it works out fine back on topic big gap to me coloring I did finish the line art I did like the line art you the hair took a long time if you can't tell and it took a lot of experimentation but I ended up really liking how it turned out and then here is it like much much further in the process I don't know how I forgot to record so much of this but apparently I did Hopefully for people with very short attention spans, this video was nice, I guess. I I personally don't like super short YouTube videos, but I would hopefully watch this if I were not making it. Yeah, oops. But I've been experimenting with the smudge tool. I specifically use the dry brush when smudging because I feel like it adds a nice texture and it doesn't piss me off as much as the other brushes do. But this drawing was a lot of fun. It took a long time because I'm still learning digital art and everything about it. And I'm me, so it's difficult just because of that. I'm very slow when I work and I'm trying to speed up the process. And I've also been trying to do more traditional art and I'd love to post videos of me doing traditional art. But at the same time, like I said, it takes me a lot of time because I have a very short attention span, which I'm trying to work on, especially with my art and digital art I can just do anywhere and I can record anywhere and I don't really have to worry about the lighting and other stuff like that. I have very bad lighting in my basement which is where all my art stuff is on my art desk. So maybe if people didn't really care about super bad lighting, well it's not like the worst, it could be much worse, but if that is okay with most people, which it probably will be because I can obviously edit the video hopefully a little bit and I would definitely post that if people would want to see it. Ever since I got my iPad for Christmas, I've been loving digital art and at the same time I kind of feel bad because I love traditional art too and I haven't been doing it as much because it's not as like convenient to do. I don't know why this clip is like this, by the way, I tried to fix it, I could not fix it and I'm too stressed out and lazy to try and continue working on it more because it's not the biggest deal in the world and I am so sorry because it's not super pretty and I really wish I could fix it I tried for a very long time but I can't I hate Apple because if Apple would have worked better then I would have definitely been able to flip the recording but it hates me and I don't even know why my iPad said it was like this I never draw like this but it's fine I was like avoiding the watch and the bracelet on this drawing for so long and I don't know why because it wasn't super hard I just am lazy and annoying. <laughs> I'm low-key kind of proud of the blue bracelet though. I feel like it has dimension and I like that a lot. The, the bracelet, this one, however, was kind of difficult because I didn't know how to do it, but it definitely isn't that bad and I like it the way it is and no one can change my mind. <laughs> 